Choosing format and frame rate. Since the Panasonic HVX200 camera can originate 21 different format and frame rate combinations, one of the most important decisions you'll need to make before your project begins shooting is what frame rate and format you will use. Go to avid.com slash p2 formats to ensure that the frame rate and format combination you are using is compatible with Media Composer and therefore which Avid project type you'll be using for post-production. With this crucial step completed, it is now time to set up your camera for the smoothest production workflow. As a reminder, the following steps are also covered in detail in the quick reference guide at avid.com slash p2 guide. In this example, we have chosen Panasonic Format 24PN. This material can be edited natively in a 720p 23976 Avid project type, or edited as DNX HD media in a 1080p 23976 Avid project type. First, on the HVX200 camera, go to menu number 5, Recording Setup. Choose Record Format. For example, to shoot 24p, select 720p 24pn. Next, again in menu number 5, Recording Setup, choose User Bit Mode. Select Frame Rate. Next on the camera, go to menu number 1, Scene File. Choose Operation Type and select Film Cam. And then finally, go back to menu number 1, Scene File. Choose Frame Rate and in this particular case, select 24. This is actually where you would select for overcranking or undercranking in the native mode on the camera. Now while there are many other checks and preparations to make prior to shooting, Taking these basic steps will ensure that the metadata associated with your clips is usable and complete for post-production using Avid Media Composer.